morning everybody I'm gonna be showing you how to make a sunny side up egg without it breaking I already heated up my stove so I'm gonna go ahead and get started for you that way we won't waste too much time I already fed the kids and I'm hungry so you're gonna get your pan you're gonna hold it away and you're gonna spray some Pam the original Pam We're letting the pan heat up a little bit. Once it starts to get a little bit warm, then we can uh, go ahead and get our egg. We're going to Tap it on the side of the pan a couple times and, and just let it go. I'm just holding the center of the egg in the middle, the yolk in the middle. That way it has some white around the edges and I like to season with some mustache original I don't know if the lighting's bad yeah because it's salt free and that way I don't have to worry about um, getting too much salt um, have to worry about diabetes and stuff, so. And plus, I just lost 33 pounds. And I don't want to ruin that either. After the baby. <laughs> I'm trying to figure out how to get this. So I'm going to lift it up for you guys. Slowly going to go under and split. See? I'm just going to let that cook. And none of this is edited or stopped or anything. We're just running through just like this. So that way you can see beginning to end. So exactly how long it's taking now is exactly how long it takes to make the egg. I'm just going to turn that back over. This side's already done. The other side is already cooked as it is. Um, just letting it go for just a few seconds. And it's pretty much done. We're just melting cheese now. It's already been seasoned. I'm using the Crafts Singles. Sometimes I use the Kirkland Singles. Just depends like where we are when we decide to buy our cheese. So. So these are the eggs. I don't know if I showed you. I don't remember. Kirkland organic eggs. The pan. So that it won't stick to the pan. The Mrs. Dash to season. So it's already done. I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to use the oral wheat oat nut bread. And since I already lost a good amount of weight, I'm going to go ahead and toast two slices of bread. If you're still trying to lose weight, it's best to just do one slice and just either make it into a half of a bread and then eat it like that or just put it on top and eat it flat. 
either or, but me, I already lost a lot of weight, so I'm going to go ahead and do two. I think I've earned my complete sandwich already. And if you do end up breaking your egg and you want it sunny side up, sometimes I get mad and I'm like, all right, I don't want to throw my egg away, so I'm going to just um, eat another one. I broke the first one, you guys, and I'm going to just still eat that one too. But on the side, not with extra bread because I don't need all that bread right now. And I'm going to be using the crunchy crock butter just to put a little pinch of um, flavor on my breakfast sandwich. Just a little bit. Okay, so my bread just popped. Go ahead and just put a little. I don't know if the lighting's off. Can you see? Just a little bit. Little itty bitty pinch. So not even thoroughly across, just um. Just a little bit. Then we're gonna carefully get our egg. So the middle and you have the perfect sunny side up egg. Okay. So for me, I like to use the Don Francisco's Hawaiian Hazelnut. It's one of my favorites. Little cure cups. So we're going to go ahead and put that in there. And just press start. My most favorite thing in the morning is to just hear my coffee brewing. To me, it's relaxing. And it's a 10 ounce. I'm putting it to brew 10 ounces of coffee. Now our coffee is complete. All right, we're on our final step now that we brewed our coffee. I like to go ahead and put um, two small little tablespoons of um, the sweet and low sugar. And they're not complete spoons, see? So it's like one spoon pretty much broken up into two. And then I use the coffee mate. So I'm going to go ahead and do the same. One. And two. And that way. I still have some kind of flavor in my coffee, but I'm not going to um, have it too sweet so I don't mess up my diet. So I hope you enjoyed the video. And if you did, please, please give a thumbs up and subscribe for more content. I will be posting more videos on... Um, food and different things like that if you're interested or you have any um, suggestions on what you would like to see me make then leave it in the comments below and I'll get back to you and take you up on that video you want to see so bye have a nice day